in the celestial realm of Vaikuntha, Lord Vishnu and Goddess Lakshmi sat together, immersed in a serene atmosphere of love and tranquility. On a peaceful evening, Lakshmi, filled with curiosity, turned to Lord Vishnu and asked, Beloved Vishnu, what is the nature of the mind and how can we make it our friend? Lord Vishnu, the embodiment of divine wisdom, smiled tenderly at Lakshmi's question. He gently held her hand and began to unravel the mysteries of the mind. My dearest Lakshmi, Lord Vishnu began, the mind is a powerful instrument that governs our thoughts, emotions and perceptions. It is like a mirror that reflects our experiences and shapes our reality. The mind can be our greatest ally or greatest adversary, depending on how we understand and train it. Lakshmi leaned closer, her eyes shining with anticipation. The mind is often compared to a restless monkey, constantly jumping from one thought to another. Lord Vishnu explained, It is easily influenced by external stimuli, desires and attachments, leading to a state of restlessness and suffering. However, with understanding and practice, we can transform the mind into a dear friend, guiding us towards inner peace and spiritual growth. Lakshmi nodded, her curiosity deepening. To make the mind our friend, Lord Vishnu continued, we must cultivate awareness and mindfulness. By observing our thoughts without judgment, we develop a deeper understanding of our mental patterns and conditioning. Through this awareness, we gain the power to choose our thoughts and consciously shape our inner landscape. Lakshmi felt a sense of empowerment, realizing the significance of mindfulness in taming the mind. Lord Vishnu went on to explain the importance of self-discipline. Discipline is the key to training the mind, just as a garden needs constant care and nurturing to flourish, the mind requires discipline to cultivate positive habits and thoughts. Through practices such as meditation, self-reflection and virtuous actions, we purify the mind and strengthen our ability to make conscious choices. Lakshmi's heart swelled with determination, ready to embark on the path of self-discipline. To make the mind our friend, Lord Vishnu continued, we must also practice detachment. By cultivating a sense of detachment, we free ourselves from the grip of desires and attachments that cloud the mind. Detachment allows us to experience inner peace and clarity, enabling us to make decisions based on wisdom and discernment rather than fleeting desires. Lakshmi felt a sense of liberation understanding the power of detachment in attaining true freedom. Lastly, Lord Vishnu spoke of the importance of self-love and compassion. To make the mind our friend, we must shower it with love and compassion. By embracing ourselves with kindness and extending compassion to others, we create an atmosphere of harmony within. Love and compassion act as gentle guides, transforming the mind's restlessness into a source of profound wisdom and empathy. Lakshmi's heart overflowed with love and compassion, realizing their transformative power. Lord Vishnu embraced Lakshmi, their divine love radiating through the cosmos. My beloved, he whispered, by understanding the nature of the mind and practicing awareness, discipline, detachment and self-love, we can transform our minds into faithful companions on our spiritual journey. The mind, when trained and harnessed, becomes a gateway to inner peace, joy and spiritual realization. Lakshmi felt a deep sense of gratitude for Lord Vishnu's guidance and teachings. I hope you learn. Om Namo Narayana.